She was born during difficult times when the Iran-Iraq war was raging. One of four children, she was born to father Ahmed Mirza Khani, who was an engineer. Her mother was a homemaker. She read biographies of Marie Curie and Helen Keller that inspired her. She became the first woman ever in the history to win the Fields Medal, the mathematical equivalent of the Nobel Prize. Yes, you guessed it right. Maryam Mirza Khani was born on May 3, 1977 in Iran, according to some 12 May 1977. As a teenager, Mirza Khani won gold medals in International Mathematical Olympiads for high school students. In 1999, she received a BSc degree in Mathematics from the Sharif University of Technology in Tehran. After obtaining her degree from Sharif University, Mirza Khani went to the United States where she attended graduate school at Harvard University. There, she started to attend Curtis McMullen Seminar. She was awarded a Merit Fellowship from Harvard University. She received her doctorate for her 130-page thesis on simple geodesics on hyperbolic surfaces and volume of the moduli space of curves. Mirza Khani's work focused on the study of hyperbolic surfaces. In 2008, Mirza Khani married John Vondrock, a Czech computer scientist and applied mathematician who currently is an associate professor at Stanford University. They have a daughter named Anahita. Mirza Khani made several contributions on moduli spaces, closed geodesics, hyperbolic geometry, topology, ergodic theory, and Riemannian surfaces. Well, to explain them, it would be too technical, and this is not the right place to do so. Many of her professors and associates define her to be infectiously optimistic. In 2014, Mirza Khani became the first woman to be awarded a Fields Medal. This medal was presented to her by the International Mathematical Union on 13 August 2014 at the International Congress of Mathematicians held in Seoul, South Korea. She became the first Iranian and the first woman in the world to be awarded with the highest prestigious prize in mathematics. Maryam Mirza Khani's parents heard the news through public media. She explained later that she did not think it was such a big thing. With Alex Eskin at the University of Chicago, she made calculations of the trajectory of a billiard ball around a polygonal table. Despite the fame and attention she received, Mirza Khani remained humble and grounded, always avoiding the spotlight. She listened to the work of other mathematicians. Even before she was awarded the Fields Medal in 2014, Mirza Khani had been diagnosed with breast cancer. She continued working on mathematics. The cancer spread to her liver and bones, and her deaths in a California hospital in July 2017 stripped mathematics of one of its brightest stars, who at the age of 40 was at the summit of her achievements. Well, this was in short my small tribute to this great personality. She passed away too early, but left behind a legacy that would take eons to get. A woman who inspired millions to pursue maths and science. The mathematics community lost one of the greatest minds. And I will miss you, Mariam. <laughs>